Well, look at here. We have some new tools. So you've seen some of my other like Appion and uh, Yellow Jacket, Richie, and um, who was the other company? Can't remember right now. Doesn't come off. But these are Navax version. And supposedly Navax version, I have not tried yet. This is my first try. And I got these, I picked these up at uh, my local Johnstone. And so we are gonna give these a try. And these are a two in one. So instead of just doing the quarter inch dry, quarter inch threads, you also can do like the Asian 5 sixteenths because they have this adapter on the end. So you have see if I can take this off here and I cannot do that one handed nope knocked it so one is five sixteenths and the other is quarter inch and so I see they have they come with some new o-rings in there on this vehicle right here this is a quarter inch because this is an old r12 system from 1990 BMW 318i so I'll be removing that core and we'll be performing our vacuum with this and I'll also hook up the Accutech Micron gauge and I'll graft out the vacuum on this vehicle, I think too, if I stick around and do it, I'm not sure. I have a full plate for tomorrow. They're gonna change the expansion valve on this because this was a moisture contaminated system. Uh, they already put the new compressor on. They did not know they needed a new receiver dryer because I told them that this system most likely has moisture contamination because if shops tried to do um, a leak test on this by using shop air or they had contaminated refrigerant because they had an old refrigerant machine and they never changed their desing bag and they had tons of moisture, this will be all rusted out. And to prove that, this was the video that I haven't released yet, but this is what the inside of the receiver dryer looks like. And that was what the exp that looked like. So they're gonna flush out the line. So all that is inside this line right here. See this line right here? That liquid line from the receiver feeds the expansion valve and everything that was in that receiver is plugging that expansion valve. And so they gotta do the expansion valve and then I'll come back and I'll demo these and we will see how these NAVAC uh, NVR1 valve core removal tools perform under a deep vacuum and I'll be uh, proving that with the AccuTech and I'll probably be putting nylog on all the surfaces to make sure it doesn't leak and nylog at anything that moves or swivels and we will be back here tomorrow demoing a tool. See you guys.